Hi everyone, welcome back to the Laravel 8 tutorial. In this video, we are going to learn about LiveWire pagination. So let's see how can we create pagination in LiveWire. So first of all, uh, let's create a new LiveWire component. Uh, so switch to the command prompt and uh, for creating the new LiveWire component, uh, just type here the command php artisan make colon LiveWire space component name. Uh, let's say component name is users. All right, now run the application. So just write here PHP artisan serve. Now switch to the project and uh, let's create the uh, route for this component. So just go inside the routes directory, then we have the PHP and here just create a new route. So just write here route get and let's say URI is of users and just add here the component class name so just write here users colon colon class all right and also add here the component class file path like this now save this file and uh, now just open the users component class file so just go inside the app directory then http uh, liveware and just open uh, users component class file all right and inside this file first of all uh, let's add liveware with pagination okay so for adding this just write here use liveware slash with pagination this one all right and now inside this render method uh, just write here dollar users and here i am just going to use uh, users mo user mo model so for that just write here user and also uh, import the user model so just write here like this user app uh, sorry use app models and user all right and now just add here colon colon uh, pagination paginate and uh, inside this let pass here the number of records i'm just going to fetch uh, in one page five records so just write here five all right and now inside this uh, just add here a secure parameter and just pass this users okay so just add here the uh, just add here an array and inside this array write here users arrow this one dollar users all right and uh, uh, before this render method just write here use this one with pagination all right now save this file now just open the users component view file so just go inside the resource directory then views and live wire and from here just open the users.blade.php file all right inside this component uh, view file let's add a table so just add here the section and i have already added the bootstrap cdn inside the uh, default layout file app.blade.php file you can see here the bootstrap cdn all right now inside this component view file just add here the section and then container and uh, uh, row then column and now just add here the card card header and inside this just add the title all users now add the card body and inside this let's create a table so just write here table and add the class table table dash script and uh, inside this table just add here the t head and uh, now tr 
and inside this here, this side here, th and id, another column which is name and email. And now just add here the t body, and inside this. Add here the uh, for each directive. So just write here at the rate for each dollar users as dollar user. And inside this for each, we are td and just print here the id inside the double curly bracket. So just write here dollar user id. And now just copy this and paste here change the column name name and here email all right and uh, for the pagination link uh, just add here after the table uh, double curly bracket and inside this is right here users arrow links all right all done so now let's check this so switch to the browser and just go to the url all user users and here you can see the five records inside the table and total records 100 and uh, there is a problem the previous icon and the uh, next icon is showing uh, large okay so just add here the CSS so in, inside this component view file uh, just add here the style and uh, now SVZ and just add here the height height uh, let's say 50 pixel now save this file and uh, just refresh the page now it's looking good all right now you can see here the pagination next button previous button all right and this is the pagination number all right so in this way you can uh, create live wire pagination so that's all about live wire pagination so thanks for watching this video and uh, if you still have any kind of question you can ask me in the comment box don't forget to subscribe my channel thanks for watching